Hello my dear friends, I am Sujoy and today in this video I will tell you how to solve a 2 person zero sum game with 2 settle points. In this video you will learn how to solve a game theory problem. Also you will learn what is the meaning of 2 person zero sum game, what is called a settle point, how to find out the column maximum value, how to find out row minimum value, what is mean by strategy, what is called payoff matrix. All you will learn along with how to solve the problem. So let's start. First let me tell you some basics which you will need to solve the problem. So this is a game theory problem. Here the term game does not mean any physical game like cricket or football but it's a logical type of game. So what is the meaning of two person zero sum game? This game is being played between two players or persons, person A and person B. Let's say it's a profit and loss type game where the profit for person A is equals to the loss for person B. So that's why the algebraic sum of profit and loss is equals to zero. So that's why it's called a two person zero sum game. Next, what is the meaning of saddle point? Saddle point is a point which gives us the optimum strategies for two players. At saddle point, the optimum strategies for two players collide. So what is the strategy? A strategy is a set of rules which defines or governs the course of operation for a player. Now what is row minima? Row minima is the minimum value in each row. For example, in row A1, the minimum value is 1, which is written next to row A1. Similarly, let's say for row A3, the minimum value is again 1, which is written next to the row A3. Now the column maxima. As the name suggests, the column maxima represents the maximum value in each column. For example, in column B1, the maximum value is 1. Similarly, in column B3, the maximum value is 9, which is written next to it. The row minimum value represents the minimum gain for person A if person A follows that strategy. For example, if person A follows the strategy A1, his minimum gain or minimum profit will be of 1 units. Similarly, if person A follows the strategy A2, his minimum gain will be minus 4. So that is no profit actually. So person A will not follow that strategy. So person A will try to maximize his minimum gain. That strategy is called the maximum strategy for person A. And the column maximum value represents the maximum loss for person B. For example, if person B follows the strategy B3, his maximum loss will be of 9 units. So person B will try to minimize his maximum loss. The strategy for that is called minima strategy for person B. So strategies are set of rules which define the course of operation for each player and each player is aware of the outcome of a strategy for him and also for the opponent. So here both the players are intelligent and rational and the optimum strategy is the strategy which brings a player to the best possible situation. So what is our objective? Our objective is to find out the optimum strategies for both player A and player B in game theory. Also, we have to find out the value of the game which you obtain from the subtle point. So as the basics are clear, let me proceed to how to solve the problem. So step one, write row minima in the right hand side. So find out the minimum value in each row and write that next to that row. So here in row A1, the minimum value is one. Similarly, in row A2, the minimum value is minus four which is written next to it. Continue the process for each row. Next, for column maxima, find out the maximum value in each column and write that next to that column. So for column B2, the maximum value is 7, which is written next to it. Similarly, in column B3, the maximum value is 9, which is written next to it. Continue the process for all the columns. Step 2. Now find out the maximum value among the row minimum values and enclose that value 
in a square box so we have enclosed the maximum values in square boxes and now for column maxima find out the smallest values among all the values so here among 1 7 and 9 the smallest value is 1 which is enclosed in a circle if this value appears more than one time you have to circle it more than one time step 3 now observe whether the column maxima value is equals or not to the row minima values so here this one and this one is equal also this one and this one is equal so we have a direct relationship and if both the values are equal and we have a direct relationship we can say the game has a saddle point or more than one saddle point in the case if a game has saddle point then the game can be solved by pure strategy which is very easy and if not then you have to solve it with applying more than one strategies at different times which is called mixed strategy game so for now since there are two row minima values being equal to column maxima value the game has two saddle points at a1 b1 position and a3 b1 position one at a1 b1 position and another at a3 b1 position thus the optimal strategy for a is either a1 or a3 and optimal strategy for b is just the b1 and payoff for a is equal to 1 and payoff for b is equal to minus 1 because remember i mentioned the profit for one person is equal to loss for another person so summation of profit and loss is equal to 0 that is 1 plus minus 1 equals to 0 that is the meaning of zero sum game so friends this was my video on how to solve a two person zero sum game with two saddle points if you like this video please like it using the like button below and please subscribe to my youtube channel by subscribing you can stay connected with me and get regular updates from me when i upload my next video you will get an email if you subscribe and please share this video among our friends and family because knowledge is meant to be shared i have many other videos apart from operation research such as on numerical methods statistics probability number systems computer science and engineering electrical engineering etc all you can get on my youtube channel the link to my channel is given in the video description below so thanks for watching see you in my next video and till then stay connected by subscribing